All right, folks. So today we're going to be reviewing the best uh, chicken nuggets in the game. And that is going to be Chick-fil-A chicken nuggets. So today I have an eight piece chicken nuggets from Chick-fil-A. And I like their chicken nuggets because they're chicken chunks. They're so, fried. They look like this. So they're not going to be healthy at all. But it's good protein. And so today I'm going to eat these with two sauces. And one is actually going to be Polynesian sauce, which I love. This is my favorite sauce. But another one's going to be Chick-fil-A sauce. So I think I had this a while ago. And um, I don't know. I just don't remember it. So we're going to see which sauce goes best on fries and chicken nuggets. So guys, I've been loving Polynesian since I was a kid. So it's really hard. Like not only does it taste good but it takes me back to my childhood. I didn't have Chick-fil-A a lot, but there was one in our local mall and there was like an Orange Julius as well if you're old enough to remember those. But, so we'll try the fries first. The waffle fries are bomb. Love them. Mm, that sweet and tangy is just so good. I could probably eat like three large waffle fries. Mm, 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 mm. That. That, to me, is the best fry combo combination out there. I'm going to say this, and I love ranch, too. It's better than fries and ranch to me. Now, can I, I could probably eat ranch more frequently than I have Polynesian sauce. So I'm going to try another fry, which these don't have salt on them. And, like, they give you a salt packet with them. But I, I would prefer them to be sprinkled with salt, but that's not a big deal. They're still very good. Mmm, 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 mmm. Okay, so I remember Chick-fil-A sauce. So it's, it's like a creamy barbecue sauce. Um, and it tastes really, mm, really good. That creaminess might go better with fries. Let me try that again. Oh, yeah. So that does. Okay, so I'm going to have to try it with chicken nuggets. Because right now, that tastes better with the waffle fries. We're going to just try a nugget plain. So it's good. The reason I like them not only is because they taste just more natural, cut chicken like something you would eat at home. But also because they're tender, they're moist. I also like the fact that they're not too greasy. So I could eat 8 or 12 of these and not feel like I'm in oil overload. I probably should feel that way, but they're not as greasy as other things. Oh, that's another thing with Chick-fil-A nuggets. They taste better composed than other nuggets. Like the coating is actually, it's not like a shell on a chicken. I don't know. It's more of a cohesive unit, if that makes sense. And the seasoning is definitely on point. They're perfectly seasoned. They're not too salty. They're not too spicy. They're just the right amount of seasoning. So... I'm going to give these a 9 out of 10 because this is what chicken chicken nuggets should be. Just natural cut pieces of chicken. So now I'm going to dunk a chicken nugget in the Polynesian sauce. And I think I may have a new champion of sauces, actually. I mean, Polynesian sauce is good, but it's sweet and tangy. And I feel like the Chick-fil-A sauce is a bit more balanced because it does have, like, the creaminess. And then you have the tartness of the tomato from the barbecue sauce and probably some vinegar. Mm, 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 mm. But I don't know um, if the whole is greater than the sum of the parts in this situation. So there's that. And by the way, I would give the tenders a nine out of 10. And then the waffle fries, I would like a little bit more salt. So I'm gonna give those an eight out of 10. Still very, very good. McDonald's fries are still, they taste better to me. But overall, I'm going to give Chick-fil-A waffle fries the win because I'm not like spitting out grease as much and I don't feel like sick after uh, when I eat a large McDonald's fry, I kind of feel sick. So there's a, a, a lesser degree of grease to potato in that ratio uh, when you go with Chick-fil-A. That's just the way I feel. All right. So now I'm going to try the Polynesian sauce with the Chick-fil-A nugget. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. All right. So I'm going to say Polynesian sauce is an 8 out of 10. And I'm going to say this Chick-fil-A sauce is an 8.5 out of 10. 
It's just the creaminess and it does have some tangy because it has a barbecue sauce element. So I'm gonna go ahead and give Chick-fil-A sauce the win. I'm not going to buy this in stores because it probably has a ton of vegetable oil and stuff like that. I don't buy Polynesian sauce either. I try to stick to mustard, just natural mustard or like that kind of stone ground mustard, whatever that's called, but. Pardon me, would you have any Grey Poupon? But of course, Grey Poupon. Yeah, guys, you cannot go wrong with waffle fries and Chick-fil-A nuggets. Um, this is definitely bomb. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this out. I would say like if you get Chick-fil-A, make sure you get the salt with the waffle fries, mix it in. If you're dipping, dipping it into ketchup, then you don't need the salt, but um, yeah, super good. Thank you for watching.